Mobility and affordability, arguably the two biggest talking points in Austin, will take center stage tonight at the mayor's State of the City address. Whether you're talking about property taxes, health insurance, or housing costs, the mayor is now calling for an affordability audit. We're told this will be the first audit of its kind in Austin, with the city auditor's findings intended to reveal what's working and what is not at a city level when it comes to affordability. And how should we be measuring affordability? After all, last year, the city council helped cut property taxes, saving the average homeowner $14 a year. I think the biggest challenges for the city in 2016 are, frankly, the, the same challenges we talked about uh, last year and have for the last several years. It's affordability and it's mobility. It's making sure the people that live here can afford to stay here. The mayor's address is scheduled to begin in less than an hour at 7 o'clock, and we have included links to help you reserve your free seat or live stream the event on our website at kxan.com. And coming up at 9 and 10 o'clock, we will break down the high points of what we're told is the mayor's 35-page speech. During Mayor Adler's State of the City address last year, he said he would try to house the entire homeless veteran population before his term expired, and he has accomplished that goal for the most part. In December, Adler said the mayor's office had found housing for some 200 veterans in Austin. But last month, one family told us they had a long list of complaints at their new apartment, including no hot water. After our report, the mayor's office told us the Housing Heroes Fund would pay for the problems. We spoke to that family today, and they confirm the repairs are underway.